Good afternoon everybody, this is Nelka again and I received another email or message from my Facebook friend. His name is Mamun Haj Hussein. He's from Syria and he asked me, Hi, can you help me? How can I simulate more than one street in the Alex program? Like 10 streets or more in the same scheme? Oh, that's a very good question. Okay. If you are not subscribed yet, please do subscribe now so you will not miss any beautiful or interesting or amazing tutorial like this again. Okay, so let's answer now Mr. Mamon. So he's asking about the street lighting design calculation, but it should be more than one. That is the good thing about Dialux Evo or Dialux because you can simulate more than one road lighting at the same time. Okay, and how to do that? Okay, let's do it now. Let's show Mr. Mamon how to do it. I open now my uh, Dialux Evo. Let's start with the Dialux Evo because it's really easy again in Dialux Regular if you're using Dialux Regular. So for now, let's focus on using Dialux Evo. So this is Dialux Evo and I'm going to use the street lighting. I'll go directly to street lighting now. And then let's just imagine I open one image here. So this is a road lighting designed by WSP. Um, for example, you want to calculate this road and the width of this road is say for 10 meters and this one is 12 meters. The other one is only say 7 meters and this one is say, I don't know, maybe 8 or it depends. So maybe it's sometimes road has different uh, width dimension because it depends on the function of the road. If it's a major highway or an internal road or a collector roads or maybe just an alley or maybe a super highway or a boulevard then there's different sizes for that okay so if you have projects like that maybe you're working in a one community or one big compound that has different sizes of road then you can simulate that one in Dialux Evo in one shot okay so I open now this uh, Dialux Evo with street lighting and you can see now I have one road if you go to the planning and there is road here so there are only two types for li road lighting the one is for the luminaire and the other one is for the road and this one as you can see I have one default road now and you can see here in this um, um, details or data that this roadway width is seven meters and the lane is two and then for example you want to simulate also a four lane um, road with of course seven times with 14 meters width then you can just do that here by boom 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 pressing this one create new road and now you can see there are two uh, graphs here at the top one is for this one and one is for this one and if I'm planning to make this one as 14 meters like what I mentioned just type 14 here and then you will say it's um, four lanes and then type four now you will have four lanes of a road and the other one only has two lanes of a road and what if for example the other road has a median okay it's also very easy all you need to do is to create a new road again and then now you have this third uh, graph at the top and then you will say I want to add a median let's say that the road lane is both sides has two lanes and you will say I will add a median here so just press median and then one road more and then now you have a road with a median so it's easy right and for example you have a road with a median and a pathway so all you need to do is create a new one just press this one until you create all those roads that you require for your project for this one example it's only two lane but this time it has for example a path walk so you add sidewalk then boom you now have sidewalk and if you say the other side has a planters then also add a planters you can do that and um, yeah so you can play now with your um, road light, uh, road designs. One is a simple one. 
the other one is this one and the other is this one and the other is this one and if you if if you want to see all of it in one shot in your report it's really cool because you can have it everything so let's just go and say add it here let's just make it like that and then also on the other side let's add a luminaire oops why it's so high let's make it six meters only there you go and uh, for example this one you want it both sides for example so i'll just so drag and drop and then i will just say both sides and then i will press this one all right so i have this both sides of uh this is so tall okay all right let's just make it say the distance is 20 meters or say 30 okay yep and then for example this one is uh what is this one ah okay it's in the median so let's say we have two uh fittings both sides so we will put that one in the middle so it's called the median luminaire and then we will add two luminaires both sides say two pieces and then now you will have your median fitting and say this distance is for example 25 meters apart all right so now you have another road and this one let's say it's an urban area so you want for example a decorative or not so pretty fitting then you can place it there either on this side or on the other side you can uh, check that one and then if you want to change the height for example and then you can also do that all right so now you have a different roads type of roads for a different uh, areas and then when you create your calculation report yes it's really cool because everything is there so go to the documentation let's imagine we achieve the last level requirements for every road and then yes so now you have your ooh, what kind of logo is that now you have your uh, complete uh, list of your roads so you have street one street two let me change this one with it okay never mind with that logo okay now you have your street one then street two all those summaries are here and if you want to get all the informations for everything you can also do that so for example this one and then the result and then another one and then you get also the result yes so everything is here and when you print it for example i will determine the page count now and then i'll say and i will save it so the report will give you everything in one shot and it's really cool about the dialogs evil because it gives you everything in one shot okay so i can save it now and let's say one and then let's open it and then there you go now you will have the report for every uh road lighting that you created for both road one two three four five and six seven in just one report wow isn't it amazing okay so um again uh mamon i hope you learned something today and if you want to learn more about road lighting or street lighting you can go and visit my udemy course about road lighting and also you can also of course watch my youtube tutorials for free and then uh you can also visit my website www.enrocolightingdesign for more tips and tricks and if you still want to be my friend you keep just looking at my facebook page and I'll wait for the coupon codes for these online trainings and courses. Okay, so see you again on the next video. Bye!